The following tutorial is brought to you by WholeLoops.com. It's production time. I'm Reed Stefan, Reels Puppet in the game. Today, we've got a guest tutorial from Mr. Graham, aka Kilogram, aka the first guest to ever bless this show with a tutorial. He's going to show us some advanced sidechain techniques, so let's go. All right. Good morning. Good evening. Good afternoon. I'm Mr. Graham. I go by Kilogram. Um, I go by Milo Notice. Today, I'd like to show you an advanced sidechain technique that I've used a lot that allows me to have a kick drum or something in the low end cut through without having to worry about a, a dead mouse sounding sidechain. So, I'll just get right into it. We kind of have a kick drum and it's very... You can sort of hear it. Um, what I like to do a lot is kind of just solo the low end first and see what's going on. So let's go ahead and do that. Um, this is at around two. Let's listen. So, so we have a lot of low and the kick drum's hitting around right here, like one something. So I'll turn that off. First thing we need to do is put an EQ on the whole group and we need to high pass the whole thing. So, we high pass it. I would like to, I like to use around 150 for this. And I will group this to start creating the two different uh, bands. They call them bands, so the frequency bands. So the first one's gonna be from 150 to infinity, or 20K, I guess. And then the next one is going to be anything lower than 150. So what I did was I just alt click. Here, I'll show that one more time. I alt click. You can alt click and drag this. It'll make another one either in the chain or you can drag it to uh, the area down here and it will create a chain for you. Do your 808 sound like floppy trash? Are you constantly struggling to fix weak snares that just never cut it? Here at Whole Loops, we can solve your struggle. Introducing Urban Beats Volume 2, the sequel to our blazing hip hop and R&B drum kit. This time, we've doubled the sauce and created the perfect selection of special snares, pop and percussions, and 808s so disrespectful, you'll be getting noise complaints in 60 minutes or less guaranteed. Urban Beats 2 is available only at holoops.com. This now has two different audio signals coming in from this group and they're the same so you'll hear the high pass and you also have we have another high pass here but if i take this and i make this into a, a low pass we have this two bands separated so this is the high pass and this is the low pass so i'll just rename this low end and I'll rename this to high end. And now what we need to do is to really get this kick to kind of come through the mix. So I'll take a compressor and I'll put it on the low end. An Ableton compressor. We can easily side chain from the whole loops kick and use the EQ technique to make this kick um, a little bit more reasonable. So sometimes, if uh, if you want the full kick to cut the bass out completely, we don't use the EQ. I'm gonna use this technique with the EQ right here, and we're gonna see how this sounds. So I'll bring this down. gain up a little bit and now the kicks coming through but it's not in an obvious side chain way like how this would sound it's in a more subtle way where the bass is 
being removed for the kick. And without this effect, the kick will fall right back into the mix. Yep. So that's it. That's all I have for you today. Uh, thanks for bringing me on the show, Reed. And um, hope to see you next time.